hello everybody welcome back to another tutorial today we got a addition to the simple elevator multi-floor elevator we made in a previous uh, video we will be getting some uh, call elevator buttons on the outside and also we will get some uh, inside and outside doors connected and wired up um, I got it all wired up right now and I think it would take too long for me to do it as we go so instead I'm just gonna show how it's all wired up and hopefully you guys will be able to follow along that way so yeah let's try and uh, take a look at what's going on so basically the first uh, thing is the call buttons so if we go here right now it's on the uh, top floor third floor if we click the button here it will go down doors will open and of course we can then go all the way up so yeah that's the the call buttons and it's probably the easiest uh, thing to set up so if we go down here to the second floor you see the button here has been wired to a XOR so that button and the button on the inside to the second floor is wired straight to the XOR and this goes from for all of the other floors as well so this one goes to the first one and this one to the same one um, but yeah so they go into the XOR, which sends a signal further to the multiply. The multiply tells the slider how far up to go. Then it gets added and added again into the blend, into a timer as well. And the blend uh, sends the signal to the sliders in the end. Good. All right. If you watched the first tutorial, you have already got most of this done. Um, so if all we just added was the XORs and a couple of buttons extra on the outside. Alright, now in order for us to have a set of doors that open when we uh, click the button here, go up, first door opens, second door opens and the sound plays. This is done by a less a lesser than and a greater than gate. So basically, the uh, we have uh, the slider servo out here with the current position, and we send the current position into the A input on both of these. Then we go into the uh, less, and we say that. The current height of the slider right now is uh, 22.89. So if it's less than 24, we put this number here ourselves. It will send out a true signal from the less. And we do the same on the other side. Because it's 22.89, it will be greater than 22. So therefore the compare greater will send out a true signal. Then these two goes into a AND gate, which checks if both of these two inputs are positive or true. And if they are, it sends the signal further into a blend. Uh, and the blend is connected to the... Sl well, it's not connected directly, but the blend here is telling how far these sliders go. So it's a 0 and a 4 or a 4 and a 0 so when it's open it goes 4 out and when it's not here it closes again but before we send the blend signal to the sliders we send it through a buffer seconds and this buffer is set to one and a half second so when this one outputs a signal this one will wait one and a half second before it sends the signal further down the line. And with that, 
We also send a signal to a NOT gate that reverses the input and into a sound block. And this is the one shot audio player and it plays a ding when uh, the door is open on the outside. So yeah, just to watch the logic, see both of these are red and the signal got sent. Maybe it's easy to see up here. I can maybe I can see how it all flows. All right, on the inside, because we have some inside doors as well, these ones open first and then the outer doors open afterwards. And actually we use the same greater and less that we use on the other floors. So this one checks the height of the slider servo. And it's the same principle, you know, from up here. This one checks the height, goes through all of this. But instead of making it go through all of this, we let it go inside the cap here. And connect it to this AND gate. Same principle as out here, just a new AND gate. But with the same input from these two. So when this is true, it goes into a OR block, which goes into another OR block. And then into a blend that tells these two sliders to open up uh, four wide. Um, and yeah. So you see now the middle one is connected. It goes through the OR blocks and down into the blend and the door opens. And yeah. This is very messy, I know, but... Uh, Maybe don't make your logic right outside of your <laughs> elevator doors. But just to prove a concept, I think this uh, is easy enough. So if there's any questions, I will try to answer them as best as I can in the comments. And uh, yeah, I hope you have uh, a great day and see you in the next one. Peace.